On St. Patrick's Day, and happy St. Patrick's Day to you and your family, or on any day, if we do what St. Patrick did, well, that gives us great power. And that is to create your own day. Don't wait for others to decide who you are and what you will be. Decide inside of yourself. Well, what kind of day today are you helping to create in your own life? It is true that with your thoughts, your words, and your activities, you help to create the kind of day that you experience and you share with others. For instance, you may think of how it feels to have no other thought than that of enjoying the life that God has given you. That would be a St. Patrick's type of thought. Now, you hold on to that feeling for just a moment and you see it filling your entire day. You envision yourself meeting people and working with them, and you see a smile on your face, and you imagine they're smiling back at you. If you're going to take a test, or if you're going to go through uh, with an interview towards a new job or a better job, you see yourself ahead of time in your mind's eye doing well. And you let that feeling of assurance help create an atmosphere of confidence and trust. As you go through your day, you know that you're not alone. You know that God is with you. And God is helping you as you're helping yourself to create a day by simply enjoying the life that God has given to you. And when you enjoy that gift of life that God has given to you, you are a St. Patrick's type of person. As it says in 2 Corinthians 9, verse 15, Thanks be to God for the inscribable gift, indescribable gift, I should say. It is something that is scribed on your heart. It is something that is scribed on the very day that you're living. And inside of you, with a deeper meaning, to where it becomes indescribable. God bless you. And again, happy St. Patrick's Day.